Chapter 2, Departments, beginning on page 3. Departments are created by the UAN user and are used in the payroll module to organize employees into groups for payroll processing. When determining your department setup, consider how you will process wages. If an employee has one pay rate, but works in several areas, such as road, cemetery, and park, you want to choose a department name that will include all areas of their work, such as maintenance, labor, or employees. Setting up individual departments, such as cemetery, road, and park, would unnecessarily complicate the payroll process. If all of your elected officials and employees are paid at the same time once a month, you would only need one department, and you could call it wages. Departments will be used by other modules of the UAN software, such as inventory, but the inventory and payroll departments don't need to be shared. In the inventory module, you want the departments that reflect who has control of the equipment. For inventory purposes, you would want to have several departments, cemetery, road, and park, because equipment may be managed by separate departments. Just because one module of the software will require a deeper level of department usage does not mean that you will use the same departments in payroll. Keep in mind the use of departments in payroll is to sort your employees into groups for payroll processing. The guided exercise 2-1 begins on page 4. Add a department. We go to General, Maintenance, and Departments. We don't have any existing departments. If you use them in other modules of the software, you may see some listed here. If you need to use the same departments for payroll, you can. If you need to add others, you can click Add to add those two. We click the Add button and add our first department. Our elected officials get paid at the monthly meeting, so I'll call that Administration and I save. We've decided that there are going to be two groups of employees, the maintenance department, and I'll save that, and then the fire and EMS department. In our township that we've made up, the fire and EMS turn their time cards in on a different day, so I may want to go ahead and process the maintenance department while I'm waiting for the fire and EMS. They can be processed together if I want. I can close that form. If I want to see reports about the departments that have been created, I would go to General, Reports and Statements, Department Reports. Select the items and I can display or print. The last item we want to check in the general module is general, maintenance, entity setup. You need to verify that the Ohio tax ID, the federal tax ID, and the entity contact address has been completed. These will be absolutely essential to completing W-2s and the 941. If the information has not been entered correctly, please correct it, save, and close.